Hi, I'm Michelle Bisbee, and welcome to the Culinary Classroom. In this video, we're going to show you how to put together a couple of simple grab-and-go salads. We're going to do a basic chicken Caesar salad, and then over here, we're going to put together something a little bit more fun and creative. This is going to be a Big Mac salad. So we're going to start with this one, and I'm going to show you how to put together the dressing first. So in this bowl, I have already put some mayonnaise, mustard, and a little bit of sugar. To that, we're going to add a tablespoon of onion, nice and finely chopped up, two tablespoons of finely chopped dill pickles. Um, if you were going to be making this in a large quantity, I would highly suggest running them right through your Roboku. We need a tablespoon of white vinegar. and then a half of a teaspoon of paprika. You can use regular paprika or smoked paprika for this recipe. And then all you do is just whisk it right together. And believe it or not, this really does taste very similar to a Big Mac sauce. When making things like dressings, I would highly suggest um, mixing them up a day ahead to really give all of those flavors in there time to sit and just combine. Um, you'll have a much better flavor in there. So once that's mixed up, you can set that off to the side. And then we can begin going through how easily assembly can be for a grab-and-go salad. I'm going to grab some gloves because, of course, this is ready-to-eat food, so we don't want to handle it with our bare hands. So for the Big Mac salad, you're actually going to have a few different ingredients. Um, we have an iceberg lettuce. I have ground, um, ground beef here that I have cooked off. I choose to lightly season mine with some garlic, onion, pepper, and a little bit of salt just to give it a little bit of flavor. Some shredded cheddar cheese, and again, those finely chopped up dill pickles. So for this one, I would suggest putting the dill pickles on the bottom, just because they have that juice that can tend to run down through everything. So put them in, you get a nice layer on the bottom of those. Let's see, to break up the color, I will go with the cheese next. And you want to put about an ounce of cheese in there. And then with the hamburg, you're going to want to do a quarter of a cup. So I have a quarter of a cup here. Measure that right out. Put it right in there. And then for the lettuce, you want to get a whole cup of lettuce in there. Because remember, your leafy vegetables only credit for half of the amount volume-wise. So you put that right in there. You might have to give it just a little bit of a squish there. Put your lid on, and you can put your dressing into probably a two ounce. This is a four ounce cup, but I would probably put it into a two ounce. And then the kids can dump it right on their plate, add their dressing, and they have a delicious Big Mac salad to eat. So then for the chicken Caesar salad, basically same idea. Um, when I put this one together, I like to put the chicken on the bottom. I have weighed out four ounces of chicken, so I'm going to split it in half between the two cups. I've weighed out two ounces of Parmesan cheese, so once again, I'm going to split it in half so there'll be an ounce per salad. I'm going to kind of shake that just so it's a little bit more level. And then here for this salad, we are going to use a romaine lettuce. And once again, you're going to want to do a cup, pour, uh, a cup of lettuce per salad, so that way you'll get a half a cup of veg in there. So 
this course got a little bit of a mess here, but that's okay. You just put those lids right on there. And then you can offer this with an ounce of croutons on the side in baggies. Um, I wouldn't necessarily mix them in because if you have any students that are gluten free, um, you could keep that separate for them. So you can put these in a baggie or another container, an ounce you know, offering for salad, and then some Caesar dressing and you have a really quick chicken Caesar salad for your grab and go section.